So you're thinking of taking an MPhil convertible, a PhD, and you want to know what it's all about. Well, let's start at the beginning. First of all, you do not have to continue in the same subject as that in which you did your first degree or your master's necessarily. But you do have to have some expertise in that subject area, and preferably a few of those around it. Being good at maths, for example, is always a good idea, even if you're doing English. You need to consider what you would like to do. You're going to spend up to seven years doing something that is extremely complex, very detailed. And if you're doing that in something that bores the hell out of you, well, it's not going to be fun. So think about what you would like to do and why you would like to do it. And look at it from the perspective of it's something you're going to be doing for a very long time. So make sure it's something you enjoy. But an MPhil and a PhD will change the way that you look at the world. It's designed to change the way you look at the world. You're meant to become much more analytical. You're meant to become much more focused on a particular area. You should end up as the expert, the person to whom other people go when they're interested in this particular topic. And that's going to mean that you're going to have to read an awful lot of academic papers, hundreds of them, possibly thousands. You're going to have to read other MPhils and other PhDs. Expect to spend an awful lot of time with your nose in a book. You need to be able to get through all this material so that you can say why your ideas are better than those of the others, why your ideas are different, to explain exactly what you have added to the fund of human knowledge. You can use this qualification to further your career. If you want to stay in academia, then a PhD is essential. If you want to continue in the world, you want to be the expert in your area, an MPhil or a PhD will help considerably. It shows that you can take a project to a very high level. So, does the subject hold your interest is going to be something that matters. It's going to take up an awful lot of your time. And so, you're going to have to kiss your family and friends goodbye, pat them on the head, and tell them that you'll see them later. If you do get lucky enough to see them, trust me, you will turn out to be boring at the time. Oh yes, I found this little paper on, and do you know, I've just done a... Yeah, it'll bore the hell out of them. But you'll get your qualification, and it'll stay with you for life.